What is up everybody and welcome back to Coco's Create. I'm Coleman. And I'm Cody. And we are back in the Kia Soul today. Yes, we are. School is out and we are homeless again. So that means we are out on the road. Coco's Create is on tour, traveling, eating up stuff as we go. Oh yeah. Yep. Coleman's world Coleman and Cody's world tour. You like Joey's world <laughs> Joey's tour. Joey's world tour. We should start eating like him too. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so we are back at Sonic in the same stall that we did the pickle juice slush review, actually, um, and we're uh, we're ready. You know, I'm, I'm sitting here. I'm, you can't see the Capital One uh, bank sign here or anything like that. No, like I that, think I think this bank is closed. Is it shutting down? I think so. Oh my gosh! Wow, it's been here as long as I've lived here. Yeah, that's crazy. It's really sad. Uh, we yeah. lost a landmark today. We did. Starbucks still open though. So that's good. Got good that. for them. And of course, so was Sonic. That's right. And Sonic has released a new product recently. Um, a little, little something called uh, Red Bull Slush. Red Bull Slush. That's a uh, slush made out of Red Bull. Yep. That's, so uh... now they've got two. <laughs> they got two types. They've got a Red Bull Slush, which is just the Red Bull Slush. And that's what we have mm -hmm. today. So we're we're trying out. And then they have a cherry limeade Red Bull slush which is you know there's a cherry limeade slush that's famous at sonic mm -hmm. and i guess they just add red bull to it yeah and uh we thought that we'd be able to get the most out of this video the most out of the red bull flavor with the red bull slush yeah. rather than getting the cherry limeade we one didn't want well. the cherry limeade to like skew it at all so we we figured straight red bull uh slam the red bull and uh and we'd be in the money absolutely <laughs> now coleman green what are your thoughts on Red Bull. Red Bull. Um, the only time I've had Red Bull, I don't think I'm actually allowed to talk about this, but um, in fact, I'm definitely not. Um, but you, you know, I when know. yeah, we we went around in a we drank Red Bull one time before a show. Is that I'll leave it at that. Um, and so yeah, um, and it was it was I. It's not horrible. I think Red Bull's one of the better energy drinks I've had. I had a five-hour energy recently. That thing's disgusting. Um, at least the flavor I had was. Um, I don't think I've ever had a monster. Really? I've, yeah. I've heard those are pretty good, but I think they're kind of gross because they're called monster. <laughs> it's just a cringe factor <laughs> yeah, for you. Yeah. yeah. My dad drinks that monster a lot. It's like a, it's like a white monster. Um, mm -hmm. Makes sense. It's and like and he, fuel. Yeah. He likes that one a lot. I thought that one's pretty good. But um, most energy drinks I think are pretty gross. I like Red Bull though. Um, and there's one called NOS. It's like the, like the which you put oh, in your I've car. Seen that. Like, there's yeah. NOS like makes your car faster yeah. and stuff. But they have a NOS energy drink, and it's almost like a citrusy. It's like orange citrus. Mm -hmm. But it's it's kind of weird at first, but it's good. I like okay. it. But uh, yeah, I think Red Bull is definitely one of the better ones. Yeah. Um. So. Uh, I don't know if we have anything. To really say about this item it's kind of wacky um yes. oh another thing you can buy at participating sonics you can actually buy just straight red bull just like cans of red bull here now mm -hmm. so um if you're looking to fill up it's probably more expensive here than it would be at a gas station or anything but hey if that's what you want then go for it and I, i'm actually i wonder if they'll put it in like, if they'll have a can for you or if you can get like, like a route 44 red bull like they'll oh. put it in like one of their big cups for you something like that i feel like there's got to be like some legal implications with maybe that. yeah <laughs> yeah that, that's a lot of that red is bull. a lot of red bull <laughs> yeah. yeah um i wonder i guess they have a partnership with red bull now so i wonder if they'll start doing that with other things like mm. not necessarily energy drinks but like other drinks i guess i don't know yeah I mean, yeah i don't know i don't know you can't really do it I mean, they have, like, Coke slushes and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. It'll be interesting. We'll see. Yeah, so, um, with that said, let's, let's take a little sniff. Let's do that. Yeah. Mm. That's Red Bull. It, it smells exactly like Red Bull. Yeah. Um, so, I guess that's a good sign? Yeah. I think yeah. it'll taste like Red Bull. I mean, how do you make a slush, really? You just take... You just take the thing, mix it with ice, right? Yeah, pretty much. So they should be able to nail this. Yeah, I mean, this should just be Red Bull with yeah. ice, really. Yeah. All right. You want to go into it? Yeah, I would love to. Oh, you suck. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. And, uh, cheers. cheers.
Yeah, I mean, that's that's Red Bull. Mm. <laughs> it, without the carbonation, though. Mm, which that's I like. True. I like that. Cause it tastes like juice a little bit mm -hmm, to me. Mm -hmm. Red Bull has such a distinct flavor, but also has so much carbonation in it mm. that the carbonation almost kind of overpowers the actual energy drink. But in this, there's no carbonation at all. Mm. It's just juicy, like you said, and it's that Red Bull flavor that you know and love. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I do wonder, I haven't really looked too much into, like, the nutrition or anything on these, but I wonder if it has, like, the same amount of caffeine as a regular Red Bull. That's a good question. Because you could get a large one of these. Yeah. And I feel like that's, like, <clears throat> literally, like, that'll kill you. Yeah. That's true. So, I don't, I don't know if it has the same amount of caffeine. If it even has caffeine, maybe they took that out. Although, I can't imagine they'd get the Red Bull flavor quite the same without the caffeine. Yeah. Well, I almost feel like maybe it's not even Red Bull. It's almost more like a syrup. Oh, like a Red that, Bull syrup? Like a Red Bull syrup that they're using. But I feel like if you're advertising it as a Red Bull slushy, you can't, you can't have it. Not caffeinated. Oh, I you feel have like to you have, have to. you have to have that caffeine because that's what Red Bull is known for. You it, know? It's an energy drink. It's I mean, an energy drink. Yeah, I expect energy from this. And um, honestly, part of me kind of hopes it doesn't because this tastes pretty good. And yeah. the reason why I don't like drink Red Bull, like just you know casually drink a Red Bull, is because it's an energy drink and like having that much caffeine isn't good for you. Mm -hmm. So I, I try to avoid like energy drinks in general because of that. But this tastes fine. Yeah. This tastes good. But that that's another thing mm -hmm. is that like. Because energy drinks are so they're so bad for you. They're really bad yeah. for you. But so many people drink them on a daily basis. Yeah. And I don't know. Some people drink for different reasons. Some people like the taste. Mm -hmm. Some people use it to wake themselves up. Yeah. But no matter what, it's not good for you. Mm -hmm. So if you know people that like it for the taste, it's probably the better route to go probably. if it doesn't have those ingredients. In I it. feel like even if it does have caffeine, it would it's be probably, less than yeah. an actual red Because milk. even still, with the ice and everything, it's mm -hmm. still... It's at least watered it, down. watered down. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, it's toned down a little bit. It's not as strong. You're not getting the full amount because it is mm -hmm. lessened by the amount of ice that's in there. Yeah, well. for sure. For sure. I agree. And honestly, I mean, good job, Sonic. Mm -hmm. they, they did very well on this. It tastes exactly like Red Bull. Yeah. Yeah. It tastes like Red Bull, and it it's good. It is good. I'm I'm a sip on it. Yeah, I like it. I'm a sip the scissor. Sip the scissor. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, yeah, no, definitely. This is one of those one of those instances where it tastes exactly as it's promoted, and you know, like I said before, that gets at a lot of points. I feel like, and um, the fact that it's good, yeah, helps a lot. Yeah. Um, so Cody, with that being said, you know it tastes like Red Bull. It tastes good. What'd you rate this item? Well, I've said everything I have to say about it. It's good. It tastes just like Red Bull. Don't know if I'll feel all hyped up later or not. Mm -hmm. Maybe. We'll see. But uh, I like it a lot. And it's a solid drink. Um, so, Sonic, I'm going to give the Red Bull Slush. I'm going to give it a 9.2. 9.2. 9.2. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'm trying to check my pulse to see if my heart rate's <laughs> going up, but I didn't know what it was before, so it's not a very good test. Um... <laughs> But honestly, uh, yeah, I gotta say it uh, it tastes good. I mean, they hit the nail on the head with Absolutely. the flavor, and it's surprising me. I've never really thought about how good just like Red Bull tastes, mm -hmm. like, but it it does. Um, it's very juicy. It's a very juicy drink, and I think that works so well with slushes. You know, like you usually, you know, you mentioned they have Coke slushes, but those aren't too popular. Usually you're going to go for the sweet stuff. Yeah. You, you're going to go for, you know, like a strawberry or something. That's mm -hmm. a very common. And so with that being said, I, I think it works very well. It tastes like Red Bull. It tastes good. I'm going to have to give this, I think a 9.4. 9.4. 9.4. Wow. Yeah. 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 That's so, good. So this is, this is a very enjoyed drink it's a likable mm -hmm. drink from coco's create oh yeah um sonic you you have done a phenomenal job with this um the only reason i gave it a little bit lower than a, a 10 is because it's not what i would go to on a regular basis mm -hmm. it's, it's a little sweet um i can't drink that much so i'll probably don't know if i'd ever be able to go over a small but yeah i like it though yeah, yeah no i agree um so yeah sonic great job with this your movie trailer wasn't so hot but um um, this drink is really good. <laughs> I would just like to say, um, after this video, we are boycotting Sonic because of the because of the trailer. The trailer. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. no more Sonic for no us. No more. Which, um, until they fix the Sonic design, <laughs> which they are apparently. 
it's all a hoax. They already fixed they already it. Had they it, they yeah. had it. There's no way they can. Yeah. They're not gonna redo a whole movie within like five months. <laughs> it makes me question: What if you know they had released the trailer? Like if they had the backup beforehand, but they released the trailer, and everyone liked it, and they're like, "I like this version," and then they're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> "Yeah." That's a good question. That would have been interesting. Maybe they made them both. Yeah. Oh yeah. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. They've just been sitting on both versions. <laughs> you all right yeah so i think that's it yeah yeah i think so well with that being said if you like this video go ahead give us that thumbs up subscribe do all that jazz but if you didn't like the video that's okay give us that thumbs down we we are okay with that but if you give us that thumbs down we ask that you please drop a comment down below and tell us what you didn't like so we can make our videos better for you that's right and like cody said if you like this video uh make sure to hit that subscribe button and if you hit that subscribe button and you want to be notified of whatever we post whatever it is Go ahead and ring that little dinger bell. Ding! Like that. And YouTube will send you a notification of whatever we post, whenever it is. You'll be the first to know about it. Absolutely. And don't forget to check out our Instagram, Cocos Create. We'll drop a link down in the bio. And also don't forget to check out our podcast, The Film Taters, on Spotify and Apple Music. We'll drop a link down below to that. Season 2 just finished beautifully. And uh, Season 3 is going to start in a couple months. So make sure you catch up now. That's right. And uh, with all that said, thank you guys so much for watching and uh we'll see you in the next one bye, bye.